in this video i will show you how to fix your linux min boot menu after you've removed windows from a dual boot setup i'll walk you through repairing grub so linux min boots cleanly again first open your terminal the simplest way to remove the leftover windows entry is to refresh grub's configuration simply type this command and hit enter it will ask you for the password after that grub will scan your disk for installed operating system if windows has been deleted you should see only linux mint installed i haven't deleted windows yet because i'm still using it for some other programs so as you can see i have found windows boot manager if you have deleted you will not see it but what if you can't boot into mint at all for example you'll get a grub rescue screen or a black screen then you'll need a boot repair tool for that we're gonna need to create a live usb drive just like you used to create to install linux mint on your computer once you created the live usb drive go ahead and boot from the live usb drive insert your linux mint usb stick and when the computer starts we need to press a dedicated key to start from the live usb drive in my case it will be f12 so just press it rapidly a few times to bring the boot menu from the boot menu, select the USB drive you have inserted and press enter. Then in the GRUB menu, select Start Linux Mint 22.2 Cinnamon 64-bit or whatever version you're gonna have at the moment when you watch the video and press enter and it will start booting into the live USB environment. Once you're on the desktop, connect to the internet and open the terminal again. Now install the boot repair utility with these commands. Press enter then type sudo apt update and type sudo apt install boot repair press y press enter once it's installed start it with boot repair when boot repair opens click recommended repair it repairs most frequent problems it will automatically detect your linux installation and reinstall grub correctly the boot successfully repaired click ok close and go ahead and shut down your computer Remove the installation medium and press enter. You should now see a clean GRUB menu, no more Windows entries. But in my case, of course, I do have Windows because I haven't deleted. But in your case, you wouldn't see it and you would only see Linux. And that's it. You've successfully repaired your Linux main boot after removing Windows. 